My name is Kaylin, and I'm in 10th grade. Before following Jesus, I knew Christianity was a thing, but I didn't go to church much when I lived with my mom. I knew it was a thing, but I didn't feel a part of it. Before Jesus, I didn't feel like I was ever good enough, and I felt like I didn't deserve the basic things human need. I also struggled with anxiety really bad just before starting church regularly at Beachside. In eighth grade, I just went to church because I had to, but the more I went to camps and retreats and heard messages, and the more I was involved constantly, then more I realized what God does for me and for others. I felt like it was something I could have. Daytona was a big part because it was just so much more time with Jesus in small groups. Following Jesus has changed my life because it has made me more open to, talk, to taking opportunities and to stepping out of my comfort zone, recognizing what I thought was a coincidence and really God moving in my life. Overall, I'm a nicer person trying to live like Jesus. To me, baptism is the final step to fully surrendering to him and to show everyone else that my know, I know that my problems and struggles are used by God for a reason and I trust him and believe him and I want others to see that. This will make my faith stronger. Something I really struggled with after deciding to get baptized is the need to be perfect or not struggling with anxiety at all. I still sometimes feel like I don't deserve anything and that I'm not good enough to get baptized. My small group leaders keep reminding me that I don't have to be perfect and that no one deserves God's love, and that's the whole point. I would like to take my small group leaders, Miss Michael, Gracie, and Brenna. Even if I was a quiet run in the room, you guys involved me, and you opened my faith, and you made me grow closer to the things. And the things you said mattered even when I didn't show it. I'd like to thank my parents for consistently making me come to church because it was somewhere I wanted to be. I'm here today to say that Jesus is my Lord and Savior. Kaylin, I love how you mentioned that you struggle with feeling like you don't deserve to get baptized because of your worldly struggles that you go to. I am just so proud of you for understanding that getting baptized isn't saying that like, I've got it all together, I'm perfect now, I have no struggles, but it's just showing others that you choose to battle those with Jesus by your side, which is the best way, the easiest way. Um, it was my honor to shave off one of your eyebrows at camp <laughs> last year, and now it is my honor to baptize you. So today, I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. <laughs> 